Hi, this is Pops. We're here today to bring you a story about a man named August Bernard Coleman. He tattooed in North Fork, Virginia in the 1900s. The book, the collection, highlights his life. In this book, you'll find flash, stencils, and photographs of that era. When I look at these stencils and flash, I can only imagine what this time was like. In the 1900s as a young sailor, it must have been the experience of a lifetime to have traveled to parts unknown. As we travel further and further into the Coleman story, we find ourselves caught up in a time when coal-burning monsters ruled the seas and boys became men who sailed the oceans. This was an era of war, politics, Teddy Roosevelt, fashion, the Great Gatsby, the Gibson Girls, Flappers, Vaudeville, Burlesque, and the Great White Fleet. It was a time like no other. This book is about Coleman, who tattooed in North Fork, Virginia from 1918 to 1950. He was considered one of the finest tattooists on Maine. His work, okay, his tattoos were considered the epitome of what a professional tattoo should look like. Mary Ann Smith should be commended for preserving this collection for 37 years. It is now property of the Museum of American Tattooing. The Collection, The Coleman Story, the Museum of American Tattooing, on display.